Hey what's up I'm Izio Cole and Watch Dogs Legion has a really cool map with a bunch of different places that you can explore and cool futuristic areas. So today I thought I'd make a video on some of the cooler locations in Watch Dogs Legion. For this video I'm gonna ignore places like Big Ben or Buckingham Palace because obviously everyone knows about them and sort of focus on some of the locations that are smaller, still cool, but you might have missed in your playthrough of Watch Dogs Legion. So let's get right into it. The first thing we have is Tate Modern, which I like to call the Hologram Garden in Southwark. Now this is just a bunch of like holographic statues and crowns and signs and they have these little like holographic guards which I think are pretty cool. And it's like details like this that show that Watch Dogs Legion is in the future, it's set in the future, and just adds that much more believability to the story. Next up we have these shops on Camden High Street with a bunch of holographic signs and I especially love the contrast of the blue hologram scorpion with the red and orange hologram dragon. I think honestly the glow and the lighting in this game is really beautiful and places like this really highlight that and to think that I'm not even playing on the best settings I can't even imagine what this game looks like in RTX. And right down the street we have this shop called Exomod at the Camden Market. Now I just think the colors on this one look really nice, like the green and the purple that contrast and they have this little like hologram display thing. I think the whole building looks pretty cool and just thought I'd throw it in here. And number four we have the bottom area of the Nexus Tower. Now you're probably familiar with the Nexus Tower, it's like one of the tallest buildings in the game and there are quite a few big story missions set in the Nexus Tower. But what you might not have noticed is this little area at the bottom of the tower that honestly I think looks really cool. It has this like blue stripey terrain cement thing going on. There's a train station so people are coming out from the train, the bottom of the tower like I said, and a cool hologram. I think once again the glow looks really nice here, the blue glow, and the, there's different shades of blue as well which I think is really nice, and I think it just looks really good. Next up we have City Hall, now this is one of my favorite spots in the game. This is located in Southwark, and first of all I would just say this building looks really nice, it looks a lot like the Vancouver City Hall in real life, and I think it is a really nicely designed building, it looks futuristic. And they have this little area right here that's like a music tunnel. So you step on these plates and it starts playing the beat of a song at first. And then the song gets more and more complex as you walk down. I don't know if I can play it or not, but you can visit it in the game and it looks pretty cool. And it's just a, a small interactive thing that doesn't add anything to the story, although there was a mission set here. But it doesn't add anything to the story, but it just builds the world, it builds the atmosphere, and it just adds so much to the game for being a small detail. Next up we have another music thing, although this one isn't a song, it's the British Theatre and Lambeth, and there are these like panels with like, I think they're Shakespeare quotes or something like that, and they light up and they play notes when you walk on them, and it's just pretty cool. But it's just one of those things that they didn't have to add, it's not necessary for the game, but it's just somewhere I like to go and just, just hang out and, you know, fly drones, and it looks really cool. And the last one I wanted to talk about is at the County Hall in Lambeth. Now there are two things. The first is this holographic clock, which I think looks pretty cool. I don't know if this is synced up with real world time. I honestly don't even know how to read this clock. Uh, it's a very strange clock, but it's like a world clock and it shows like the time across the world. And I think it looks pretty cool. This whole plaza area looks cool and right next door is my f more, basically my favorite part in the game and that is this holographic chess piece set. I don't know what about it makes me like it so much but I stumbled across it one time while I was playing and I just always come back here. I think it looks cool. It's a really cool place to take photos and I'm not necessarily the best photographer but I can see some video game photographers getting some pretty cool shots here. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about these locations. Did I miss anything? What is your favorite location in Watch Dogs Legion? And I'll see you on the next video. Peace.